Yeah, the TRX is uh, certainly one of the easiest ways to get into automated welding. Um, the biggest feature would be it, it allows for hand guidance to do the teaching. So we can just squeeze the dead man and move the robot by hand. Um, we have four different jog modes available. In free mode, it's basically in joint, everything's free. If I hit uh, this button here, it's changing jog modes. Okay. That one locks it, the tool center point, into a fixed orientation, which is handy for welding. We can then rotate around the tool center point too to set the perfect torch angle. And our fourth mode is kind of a um, custom one with the defaults to basically allowing some rotation around Z2 as well as translation. Okay. Good. So usually you're going to be teaching in translation. Okay. You set your TCP. So when you say teaching, you really, you, there's no real sitting at a computer programming or programming much at all, correct? Nope, not at all. Yeah. It's all done with the tablet there. Okay. So here's the, uh, here's the control. So you can see me switching through the job, uh, job modes by pressing the button. Oh yeah, okay. And he's just, yeah, pressing that. Okay. So this option, the manually guided teach option, comes with a handle teach icon. And if we drag that up to the timeline, this button is now listening. Uh, okay. So if I okay. move the robot to where I want, that's an approach move. I okay. touch the button once, uh -huh. and it'll put a move on the timeline. Okay. Interesting. So that's a, is that a fairly standard uh, way to conceptualize a job like this? Use a, a timeline? No, the, the timeline program is brand new for CRX. Okay. Um, it does support the conventional uh, iPad and interface too, if you're familiar with Panic Robots. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, but the, the timeline is the new graphical representation of her. Very interesting. Okay. So I'm going to continue and actually get my wire into the joint. And if I hold this button, the light will come on and that indicates I'm recording a weld start. Ah, uh, okay. So, record on. Good, and I saw you, you could be really um, detailed and specific on where that wire was ending up. Yep, and what you do between the points doesn't really matter. Okay, so, so we're just moving it. Nice big long arc there. If I wanted to teach some intermediate points, then I would be... Okay. I would touch this again if I wanted to record an intermediate weld point. Okay. And I want to record the weld end, so I'm going to hold it until the light goes off. Okay. And that records the weld end over there. All right, and that's a part of the timeline then. And then if you stay on that while I record the, the, the clear move, okay. that's what happens. Uh, that's okay. the clear move. All right, I did notice also while you were doing that, this, this light on the kind of shoulder of the arm here was... Yep, that's the indicator that you're in jog mode. Ah, okay, so that's, that's, that's a the moving robot. guidance is enabled. So okay. you're in control with this three position safety rated enable switch. Gotcha. I'll record another clear move. And then when we're ready, we can go straight to welding.